Blessings, everyone. Thanks for being here. Take a moment to find your seat. To slow down. Beginning to greet yourself in whatever form you're showing up today. Honoring that you are perfect, whole, and complete. Just noticing what is arising in the moment. As you begin to establish your seat, Recognizing that whatever is coming up right now, whatever part of you that is alive in this moment is deserving of more love, not less. Finding the breath as the temple that holds whatever sacred experience that you are feeling or experiencing right now. If you're feeling a little ungrounded, you can always take one hand to the heart and feel the heart beat. Can you begin to cultivate and embody this quality of stillness? Not jumping up to do anything or to change anything about what is here right now. Can you allow the river of your being to flow while holding space from this place of stillness? And we cultivate this witness state, realizing that there is a part of us that can observe, oh, I am having a thought or oh, I'm having an emotion or a feeling. That is the witness. So we are not only our thoughts and our emotions when we find and cultivate and embody this relationship with stillness. It becomes the container that can hold anything that arises. Nothing to become, nothing to overcome, simply greeting your experience 
with respect, honor, faith, and surrender. Seeing if you can feel this stillness arising from within you. Allowing it to bubble up and expand. The stillness holding your thoughts and emotions. Why a mother holds a baby. Feeling the stillness approaching your being with reverence, cherishing whatever is here and inviting it to also find stillness, simply inviting If whatever needs to be there needs to stick around a little bit longer to feel seen and acknowledged, held and loved, give it permission. Like in Rumi's The Guest House, open the door, let whatever emotion into your house. Even if they come in and steal all the furniture, let them be there. Allow your house to be still. Allow the breath and the stillness to be there together. The inhale, feeling that field of stillness expanding. With the exhale, relaxing deeper into that stillness. Finding this attitude of equanimity. Approaching each experience with this quality of stillness. deeper and deeper into this trusting, into this space there is nothing to become, nothing to do.
every part of you. Welcome back to the light of the soul, to be seen, cherished, loved to completion, alchemized into love completely. Recognizing that this stillness is not something that you are bringing from outside of you, that it is arising within you. If this stillness is uncomfortable, honoring that that part of you is still deserving more love, not less, and to greet it with the equanimity of silence, stillness, and to hold that experience with love. Oh, sweetheart, I'm sorry that you're uncomfortable. Let me hold you, hold you until you feel seen and loved, cherished, honored and revered in the ways that you deserve. If stillness is the mother that holds the baby of your emotions and experiences. And the breath is the arms of the mother. So allowing the breath to ground you and keep you present in this stillness, in this holding of every part of yourself. Giving yourself permission to see whatever is here, to honor it, to not fight. When you're still, all of these layers of conditioning and programming preconceived notions, belief systems, and judgments 
start to arise. They want to be noticed and loved as well. Instead of just operating in the background, stillness gives us this space to see and honor all that was hidden before. Even the discomfort can lean into it and welcome it. And our comfort zone expands. Meditation is not about not thinking. It's not even about finding peace. Meditation are ways that we can begin to welcome everything. It is ways that we can unravel our overstimulated nervous system and really see parts of ourselves that haven't been seen in such a long time. And those inner children inside of you want and need your loving gaze, your attention so, so badly. Give yourself permission to bask in the radiance of this stillness so that you can really see what parts of yourself have you been running away from? What parts of yourself did you leave in a dark room a long, long time ago? What parts of you are ready to be seen, to be lifted up out of that dark room and to be held and loved? cherished and honored. I'm going to end the stream here shortly and I invite you to stay in this stillness a little bit longer, guided by your own consciousness, your own inner child, and to really be here and feel. Thank you. I love you. Namaste.